Hey everybody, it's Missy McWorry with more than just a vocal coach.com. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe, please hit like, and if there are any videos you'd like me to react to, please leave it in the comments section below. Or like this guy did, you can subscribe to the Patreon and be guaranteed that I will react to your videos. So today I'll be reacting to Afra Haza, The Whole Soul, and I have no idea what to expect. I'm looking forward to it. The only thing I did notice briefly, I saw a comment that uh, this singer is no longer with us, so very sad. But let's check it out together. Wow. Kitty loves him. She just loves him. This woman's voice is heaven sent. What can you even say? I had several thoughts as a vocal instructor that immediately poof just went away. It's amazing how just a beautiful, beautiful tone and vibrato can just hypnotize you. This music is just, I mean, it's beautiful. It's so beautiful. But more importantly, this singer, I know the kitty's distracting me a little bit. Are you going to let me enjoy the video? Will you stay in my lap while I do this? No. <laughs> She's had enough. So one of the things I was noticing, she relaxes and opens up her jaw as she sings. But there were several times where you can see her teeth are pretty closed. I wouldn't regard it as jaw tension. That was a personal choice, you know? The greatest singers you will find that when they sing, they may use the jaw to manipulate the sound. She chose to oh, let it be housed in here, but that doesn't stop it from reverberating on the interior. Her resonance is, is just beautiful. So when you have a relaxed interior, the sound will just naturally reverberate. And actually we can get the combination of the vibrato, the pitch waver, and the volume waver, and it all 
is syncing up nicely in her sound. So when I say she has a nice resonance, really what I'm referring to is the interior of her throat is relaxed, her larynx is relaxed. So it doesn't matter if she's e -I -E. It doesn't matter because everything is resonating so beautifully. But that tone, you cannot buy that tone. You can't buy that, okay? You know, you can work on your voice and everybody can improve in their tonality by essentially relaxing the muscles, relaxing the interior like I was just talking about. But that tone, that timbre to her voice. Thank you, Yurik. I believe it was. Thank you for the individual that tipped me off and asked me to listen to this because I don't care what style music you give me to listen to. I just want to hear something cool and creative or just a beautiful tonality. And ultimately she's, you know, she's getting the proper support mechanism as she sings. And man, was that bold starting just a cappella like that. Hearing, you can hear everything about her resonance right out of the gate. And like I said, it doesn't matter if her jaw is closed or open. Uh, she's, everything on the inside is relaxed and allowing the sound to reverberate and create beautiful overtones. So I would like to listen to more. stuff and where she went up high and her hand indicated what was I need to hear that that was beautiful that was okay mm. that's what's for lunch Okay, this is what I talk about in here all the time. When you have a vocal pass like that, you know, people tend to want to manipulate the sound, tensing the jaw and tongue. But what you have to always remember is we're finding all those notes down here where your larynx is. going through a pass people want to move their jaw with it and she's just textbook here allowing her jaw to not move to find the notes you let your larynx do the well you let your folds do the jaw you have to allow it to happen we have a tendency to want to overcompensate with the tongue and jaw all the little muscles 
tensing around there instead of just letting it happen the way she just did. So anyway, let us continue. so cool. Let's listen to that again. Fantastic. That last little pass makes me. Hmm. <sighs> wow. Wow. Thank you so much. My God, she is cool. This is a textbook singer. Her technique is fabulous. Just, I was reviewing the last passes there because she's like, holy crap, just, she's... Uh, chill. That's how you should be when you're singing through parts like that. And that's a big part of what vocal, you know, coaches do is try to get you to train your muscles to chill out so that you can run through through these passes, you know, without stressing out extra muscles because ultimately when you have too much uh, assistance happening, you can run into uh, vocal issues. This is a part of, you know, where vocal coaching is so imperative for a lot of singers because, you know, where she's making it look easy. How is she making it look easy? She's She's not trying so hard in here. Watch her from beginning to end just her resonator is so relaxed and it's reverberating nicely. She's obviously getting her air, a uh, nice steady flow from the diaphragm muscle. Her posture is just fine. She's fluid in her motion. She's allowing herself to move. She's not rigid. All of this plays a part in what makes her sound so great because uh, you can't have a tense body and you can't have a tense resonator um, for this music to for her voice you can't have a tense resonator for your voice to reverberate that nicely and to get all those overtones it's just epic pretty much right so let me just say thank you again to the patron who suggested this i am super grateful because i love all the suggestions that i get on my youtube channel but i would i i don't know how i would have ever come across this or noticed it if it weren't for you Thank you, and if you're new to my channel, please subscribe, please hit like, and if there are any videos you'd like me to react to, please leave it in the comment section below, or become a patron and your suggestion will get done, that's a promise. Just, just what a treat for me to listen to this morning. Alrighty, peace.